An auction house in Gloucestershire has sold a unique piece of RAF memorabilia today. Under the hammer went the logbook in which the legendary pilot Sir Douglas Bader recorded the crash which led to the loss of his legs. Tim Cooper reports. According to auction estimates, this slim volume is worth between 15 and £30,000. It's Air Ace Douglas Bader's logbook, charting his early career and has created a huge stir in collector's circles. It might fly past my estimate, but I have, at this point in time, when we're just ahead of the sale, I haven't got any definite ideas of just how it's going to go. So it's exciting for me and it's exciting for everybody else right up to the last minute. Douglas Bader became famous for overcoming adversity after losing both legs in an air crash. Despite that, he flew in the Battle of Britain. Later, he was shot down over Germany and tried several times to escape from POW camps. It's a strange feeling to be holding this. Everybody knows about Douglas Bader, what happened to him and what he achieved during his career. But to have the book in your hand that details his first flight with the RAF on the 13th of the 9th, 1928, to that fateful day where he had his accident, it just reads, cross-country, reading, crashed, slow rolling, near ground. Bad show. Very understated. Sends a shiver through your spine, actually. The Gloucestershire auction house was packed for the sale. The logbook's current owner is donating money from it to charity and hoped it would be sold for the benefit of the public. It needs to be on show. It needs to show people that in serious adversity, there is a way back. After 107 lots of aviation memorabilia, the book itself came before an expectant room. It eventually sold near the top of the auctioneer's estimate. £24,000, first time, second time, all done and going. 24, thank you. And that should have been that, but it seems that no one was quite sure who'd bid the £24,000 for Douglas Bader's logbook. So, in the end, the underbidder at £23,500 will be going home with it. It shows that even now, anything connected to Bader is just that little bit out of the ordinary. Tim Cooper, Forces News, South Cerny in Gloucestershire.